Okay, so this is so you get to hear which each amp sounds like. So here is the Marshall. At some point. Here is the Marshall. Marshall TV 6505 setting uh, Highs and lows crank mids dump Just so you know, yeah, I moved my input jack to the back guy, and I know I've told the story, so. Uh, here, so you can hear the PV. second please what am i on here well not what drug am i on but what else am i on? okay i think i'm on the right setting uh let's crank up the. all right so oh you know what just so you know i don't live alone here but my amps are all here because where i the other place i live i can't uh, leave the amps there. Let's just say it's more of a crash pad. That's why it's 200 bucks. Come on, think about it. It's another state. Cheap, yes. 200 bucks cheap. But I don't trust. And it's a little town. Like I said, it's outside of Tokerville, Utah. Very small town, but it's also out, it's what, 40 minutes? Half hour drive from St. George. And St. George, there's a lot of, uh, you know, anywhere out, you know, there's tweakers. So I just don't trust anything. Here is all, here, all my amps are at, well, not, well, almost all my amps are here. Guitars, they're in three different places. Here, not at the place in Utah, but at my son's and my friend's house so those are that's it because i don't want to keep them anywhere my address because of these videos that's why you see the same guitars but every once in a while you'll see a different one because i'm having it serviced or i just want so that i brought this and my uh iceman uh white zombie with the green one with the stars <laughs>
story but I can't remember one <laughs> okay here's a quick story for those of you who okay you've suffered through the plane so I'll give you a story okay oh, think 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 there's so many of them okay <clears throat> I was with this girl I was driving her home after a show she was pissing me off because she wanted me to turn the music. I was listening to, I think it was Motley Crue. Because it was usually Motley Crue. And she's like, shut that up, shut that up. And she had her little boom box with her. So I took the boom box. This is something I had a Chevy S10. Took the boom box, threw it out the window. This is on the 5 freeway. And she starts screaming and yelling. I'm like, shut up or I'm pulling over and you're getting out. No, no, please, please, please. Okay, fine. Next thing I know, she's uh, without clothes. So, I'm like, crap, man, it's 3 o'clock. We need to get something to drink. So, pull off the freeway, get over 7-Eleven, and I get out, and there's a guy in there, and I'm like, dude, I know it's past 2, but will you sell me a case of beer? He's like, can't do it. 
I go, wonder if I would show you a live, naked woman. He goes, yeah, you do that. And I'll give you a, a case of beer for free. Um, I go out to the car. <laughs> so he went out, looked at her, and he's like, oh, ooh, very good, very good, very good. He comes back in. Case of beer. Beep. Get on the freeway. She's so happy. We're drinking. Yay. Drink, 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 drink. So she's like, oh, you know, gets a little excited because we've been reading, you know, wants to read books. Read books is, you know, quote, cover for. So she's ready. So now I'm trying to drive as she's reading a book to me. And that's very hard to do on the freeway after already drinking like, you know, 12 beers. So doing that. And uh, I'm like, I can't do it. I can't do it. This is crazy. So we pull over to this divider in the freeway. And turns out it was the 5 and the 210 or 134 were divides. I pulled over right in the middle, stopped. We got in the back of the truck and fell asleep. Well, we did fall asleep for about an hour. And then the sun came up and... All of a sudden, I hear this honking and screaming, and not like horrible screaming, but screaming like, and I'm like, oh my gosh, what, what is going on? And I sit up, and I, I'm like, and she's just sitting there drinking a beer, you know, getting sun rays, and I'm like, wah! <laughs> so I throw something over, and she's like, oh, that, I don't know them. I'm like, but you could get, if there's a cop, just keep it on. Drink the beer. Let's get out of here. And so I'm trying to, like, you know, put the books away, <laughs> dress, get in the truck, go. And that was just that night. That So that was crazy night. One, it was this girl. So go home, ba -da -da, shower, spend the day together drinking and reading books. The night comes along. I gotta go home. She wants to come back with me. I gotta, I gotta come back to Burbank. So she wants to read again. I'm like, we're not gonna do this driving. Read books. Get it. So we pull over, go into this neighborhood, and you know, tried to, it was very hard because the back of the bed and, and she went, goes, well, get out. And, you know, there's no one around. No one's going to see us because it was like three in the morning. A uh, weekday, nobody, dark neighborhood street, you know. So we get out and we're standing against the truck. She's standing against the truck reading a book. I'm reading a book to her. Uh -huh, get it? Are you getting all this? Okay. Then I hear this. I'm like. You know, it's like uh, Apocalypse Now, you know, these helicopters. I'm like, okay, where's this, the uh, soundtrack? You know, fly, fly to Valkyries. But there wasn't. It was just helicopters in a row, spraying. Now, this was the 80s when they were spraying for this fly, this fruit fly or something. I can't remember what it is. Malathion was what it was that they were spraying. I'm like, holy crap there, and they went over us and got nothing to cover us with. So before we knew it, bro, comes down on us. We're both covered in it. I'm like, holy crap, we gotta get this off. It's gonna kill us. It's gonna cause... She starts screaming. Go, shut up. Stop screaming. We go into this lawn, the front yard, turn on the hose i'm hosing her off and then i'm hosing myself off and i hose her off again because she's freaking out hose 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 and i'm just like be quiet and i'm hosing my and then this old guy's standing on the porch just with his arms folded like what are you guys doing i go oh sir this looks very bad i know but we were walking along and the we didn't realize that they were spraying for malathion so we decided we should probably take off the cl and, you know, and we'll be out of here. And he goes, you didn't have to take your clothes off. You could have just washed yourself off, couldn't? I go, I just want to make sure. And I'm like, 
but wait a minute. How long have you been staring, standing there staring at my girlfriend while I was hosing her down? <laughs> he goes, just hurry and, and, and go to bed. I'll tell my wife it was a dog. A dog? Okay, the dog's out there with the hose on. So he goes in. We get in the car. We don't put the clothes on. We drive to my house, sneak in. And, uh, yeah, so we got sprayed by Malify on the second night. First night, we were stuck in the middle of the most, one of the busiest interchanges on the freeway system. And she's, you know, 7, 6, 37, 7 in the morning. It was 7 in the morning, I remember, because we got in the car. It was just after 7. And she's, you know, pounding a beer with getting sunned. So there's your story. It's not rock and roll. It is rock and roll, but there's no band. Before the that, I did play a show somewhere in Hollywood. I can't remember even what club it was. Oh, it was a troubadour. Because I remember we, oh my gosh, there's another story connected to that. So I'll tell you that later. But yeah, we played the troubadour and then on the way back, Got all my stuff together and in the truck, and I said, "You just dump it off at," because we were storing it at my uh, parents' garage. It, uh, everything, stage set, everything. This is fatal attraction. This was like '89, and I just said, "I'm going to take her to her house." But I ended up living there for six years or five years, on and off, between where she lived, and then we moved up to Big Bear and then back. But there's your story. Hope no one from church is watching because i got to teach Sunday school tomorrow. So wish me luck on that one. That was not your Sunday school lesson because this is Saturday night. So this is your Saturday night rock and roll lesson. Late.